Patriot Prime Reviews is a channel for adult collectors and may not be suitable for children under 13 years of age. Viewer discretion is advised. <laughs> Hey, what's going on guys? Patriot Prime here once again with another video. But before I get started, I need you guys to do me a favor. If you're watching this video right here and are not a subscriber of Patriot Prime Reviews, please consider hitting that subscribe button right now. It won't cost you a thing, but will help me and my channel out tremendously. Now, on to the video. And what I have for you tonight is the brand new Funko Pop Retro Toys Transformers Trax. Now, Trax here is a limited edition figure from the Funko Festival of Fun, which was a bunch of different Funko Pop characters that were exclusives to different retailers. And Trax here was the exclusive from Toy Tokyo. As you can see, Toy Tokyo, New York Comic Con 2021 limited edition. Now, I picked up my tracks from ToyTokyo.com, and at the time of this recording, he is still available. Now, this Funko version of Trax is based upon his G1 toy look, which is why he looks a little different than some of you are used to. And I really love the vintage Transformers logo there, and you can see the box art. And I apologize, that ring light is really reflecting on this. Uh, the rest of the packaging is your basic Funko Flair. You've got the half face of Trax there. you got the figure here behind the plastic window. Side of the box, Trax 96, and he's peeking over the edge. Back of the box, more of that great G1 artwork. Trax again, and cross sales of some of the other Funko Pop Transformers. Side of the box, you got a full shot of Trax, Pop, Retro Toys, Trax 96. Also, this figure came in one of those protective cases, which is really cool. I do like these, though they are hard to get out sometimes. So let's go ahead and get Trax out of the box and check him out. So here we have Trax all opened up and out of his packaging. And I must say, Funko did a great job with the detailing on this guy. I mean, look at the head sculpt. That looks so good and just like the Generation 1 toy. The same can be said for the details there on the forearms, the knees, the feet. I mean, those look just like the Generation 1 toy decals. It's got the tires there on the shoulders, the wings here with also more decal details, and the back, you've got the Firebird logo and his missile rack. I mean, they did a really good job with this Funko. And let me bring in the Generation 1 Trax figure so we can compare the two. I mean, just look how good they did. you got the same detailing there on the wings, the forearms, the knees, the feet. They did a great job. Even has the gun in his hand right there. Now, the only articulation he has, he's a Funko Pop. The head can turn, and that is it. I... Love this guy. I enjoy all of the Transformer Funko Pops. I know a lot of Transformer collectors really aren't into these things, but I think they're a fun addition to the collection. I think I'm only missing two, Nemesis Prime and Jetfire. So yes, if you collect the Transformer Funko Pops, I highly recommend Trax here. He is spot on to the Generation 1 toy, and I dig it. Now, guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to click that bell icon to get notified when I upload new reviews. Also, if you're in any position to help out the channel, I do offer channel memberships here on YouTube, and I have to give a huge shout out to all my current channel members because it's your support that keeps this channel growing. Once again, guys, this is Patriot Prime, signing out. Hoo-ah!